It's the Woody Show. I'm Woody. That's Ramey. Hello. There's uh, Greg Gorey. Good morning. Menace is here. What is up, Woody? We got Seabass. We got Sammy. Good morning. There's Bort. There's Caroline. We got Morgan here. Vaughn's here, our video producer. Phones are open for you at 877-44-WOODY. You can uh, hit us up with a text. Friday check-ins, please. Do it. Let us know that you're out there. It's got this text from the 610. Y'all are out of pocket this morning, and I literally love it. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, MG. Yeah. Yeah. Literally. Well, it's that Friday uh, vibe, you know. That's uh-huh. Friday energy. Can't bring us down on a Friday. No. Yeah. Uh, so we got, uh, let's see, DUIQ coming up for you this hour. We'll give you a chance to win something here with the Dumbass Contest. So uh, we'll do that. And, of course, we got the Friday Fail Stories. And uh, the singing of the Friday Fail song was... Uh, just recently captured and put on one of our in-studio videos, and people are like, I've always wondered what it looked like. Oh, huh. yeah? I'm sure it looks real good. Yeah, no, sure it looks I tell you, people were impressed. Really? I mean, for what it is. Oh, for what it is. It's All right, here we go. Not good. <laughs> All right. Friday morning. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, time for your Friday Fail Story. All these people thought they had the perfect plan, the plan that could never go wrong, but then somewhere along the line, it went from being a great idea to one big stinking mega uber ultra. Yeah, look, it's, it's graded on R's curve, you know? A little vibrato yeah. at the end. Well, Menace is fighting a kidney stone. Well, Menace oh, no. doesn't sing. I don't sing. sing. We yeah. went over this. I know. I'm saying, like, uh, Sammy doesn't sing. Menace is fighting a kidney stone. So, uh, and Seabass, of course, doesn't uh, participate. Well, of course, in that. too good for that. Right. But what does that have to do with us singing fail? Well, there's only three of us. Yeah. Right. <laughs> We're, we're doing I was the, wondered where you were going. We're doing the heavy lifting, yeah. right? Like, like, like it's, it's not a, it's not a team effort as it, much as it used to be. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. all on our backs. Yeah. I see. Yeah, we've cut out the dead right. weight. <laughs> we know what it's like. Yeah. <laughs> Starting with uh, this story, there's a place in St. Louis called the Medium Security Institution, which uh, used to be a city jail. It was shut down last year. It's uh, sat empty ever since, and these three guys. Decided that'd be a good idea to break into the place. Mm. Sounds like they were uh, messing YouTube around. Or? I, it didn't say, mm. but a lot of people will do that. Yeah, they'll. You yeah, know. just out of curiosity. Um, but they accidentally locked themselves in one of the jail cells. Oh, I saw that. <laughs> and yeah, so they yeah. couldn't get out. They had to call nine one one. The police show up to rescue them from the cell, and then uh, arrested them for trespassing. Uh, the cops are still investigating what the guys did. There could be additional charges. You know, there's property mm. damage, burglary, stealing. They were like, you know making their way through this place, but uh, idiots. Wow. Fail. <laughs> I would panic. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Imagine if they didn't have cell service. Oh, yeah, because mm. they'd probably be dead. All be that, dead. Oh, yeah. All that concrete and stuff, like getting yeah. a signal out of there. Yeah. Freak the F out. Yeah. So there's this British ultra marathon runner, Josiah Zakajewski. Yes. Okay. Bless you. Yeah. Who has been slapped with a one-year ban by a disciplinary panel. It seems like uh, old Josiah here was busted using a car to ride along part of the 50-mile race. Oh, no. But then still had the nerve to accept a trophy for her third-place finish. Oh, sack of juicy. <laughs> I the, thought uh, you were pure. <laughs> they admitted to uh, hopping in the car, telling the marshals that she was injured and no longer competing, but, like, it didn't stop you from accepting the trophy. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. She blamed it on not being able to think straight. Having just arrived on a flight from Australia, how's oh, your pie how's the night pie? before? Huh. Yeah, okay. Dumbass. Yeah. yeah. I was on Fail. a plane, so my brain didn't work. And I got yeah. in the car during a race. Uh, this next story, this mother in Florida fell asleep on the couch in her living room. She was uh, startled awake by someone in the kitchen, and so she automatically just assumed it was an intruder in her house. Okay. Mm. So she uh, grabbed the gun in her purse, went into the kitchen to check it out, And as soon as she walked into the kitchen, she was caught off guard by this guy walking out. So she fired two shots. One bullet hits the guy right in the leg. Turns out it was just her son getting some snacks. Um, No. no. You don't live alone. You hear a noise. Right, yeah. yeah. That's what you assume? Yeah. He was uh, taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. And uh, police, plus, of course, the Florida Department of Children and Family, they are investigating the incident. Oh, no. (laughs) Failed. I was tired. That's not the that's not the person I, that should own. I a just gun. got off a flight. Yeah, exactly. <laughs>
Uh, a man in Phoenix was trying to break into someone's house, and he thought, hey, just like so many idiots before him, mm-hmm. using the chimney would be a great way to do this. <laughs> so uh, the first thing I thought is, you know, people in Phoenix have chimneys. Wow, yeah. oh, right. Yeah. yeah, that's a good point. Well, but I guess everybody. Cold, uh, yeah. yeah, it gets Winter's cold. cold. Winter. Yeah. Dude, yeah, super cold. On. Yeah. Well, the, Obviously. Uh, desert's cold at night. I just feel like, you know, right in the dead of winter, like you're looking at that national map, and it's like, Phoenix, 102. <laughs> right, but the nighttime. Right? But nighttime. 30 oh, at night. It's yeah. mad cold. And you got to start a fire in the wood-burning stove. <laughs> Keep everybody warm. <laughs> oh, oh. The low tonight is in the 40s. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay, what's that's the high, fireplace whatever. weather. And then what's the high today? Uh, 69. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Hell yeah, dude. Oh, yeah. Really? Perfect day. Just kidding. That's Sunday. Oh. Whatever. Anyway. So, uh, <laughs> I don't ruin the joke. The, uh, the homeowners, they heard this guy in the chimney. They called 911. Uh, the homeowner says that they, uh, that the guy knew them, but unclear what their relationship was. Also, no word on why he was trying to break in, but he had to be fished out by the fire department. Oh, no. And, uh, once he was out of there, he was taken directly to, of course, fail jail. Menace the fail. perfect excuse would be I was going to bring them presents. Like, yeah, Santa. right. I was trying to surprise uh, them. Uh, I have the wrong house. I was also throw in for you, too. Yeah, right. Yeah. I wasn't uh-huh. taking. I was giving. Yeah. And uh, finally, my favorite story of the week. A cop in California noticed this car driving around with a fake license plate. It's about 1 o'clock in the morning. So uh, they pull him over. And uh, when the officer looked at the plate closer, they could uh, tell it was obviously drawn by hand on just a regular white piece of paper. Taped onto the car with black duct tape. <laughs> there was even a fake expiration sticker that they had drawn on there, too. Okay. The uh, officer looked up the info on the vehicle, discovered it was reported stolen from a nearby city. So Uh-oh. he uh, arrested the driver on two charges, took them to jail. And uh, that, that enough is uh, enough for a fail. But one of my other favorite parts of this story is that fake expiration sticker that they drew on there. It was a date that was already expired. Oh, oh no. no. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Fail. Like, so, what? Not what? the brightest. <laughs> yeah, right. They'll never notice the difference. Nah. Yeah. Well, those are your Friday fail stories, everybody.